Okay, so already you have learned how to represent a 10 digit number in Indian header system. 10 digit number in Indian header system. Now in this video we will learn how to represent the 10 digit number in international header system. Can you remember that at the introduction video I have told you nowadays people are talking about that uh, some million, some billion like this. Okay, so these term representing a large number, these term are new to us, million, billion. So this in this video we are going to introduce that term. What is that million? What is that billion? Okay, so let us focus on the board. So, international header system, we are going to represent a 10 digit number. So, first step to write down the headers. So, we are starting. Again, starting from right side, you know the golden rule. Ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. Till this much, it is absolutely same with Indian header system. Now, the change is from here. Change is from here. What have I written? Capital H, T, H. It means 100,000. So, once again, I am telling. Once, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, ten million, hundred million and billion. Okay. Once again, once, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, ten million, hundred million and billion. Now, here capital M represents million, which is our new header. And capital B represents billion, which is also a new header. Now, large number, we have already talked about comma or separator. We cannot read a 10 digit number at a time. So, we need to use comma or separator. Now, in international header system, the representation or the position of Placing comma is just different from Indian header system. So we have told that first five are same. So just like just for that reason, one stains hundred, and after that we will put a comma, which is same as Indian system. Next, thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand. After hundred thousand, we should put another comma. Then million, 10 million, 100 million, then we should put another comma. So here in the first compartment, three digits. In the second compartment also, three digits. In the third compartment also, Three digits and then the next one is one digit. Okay. So how to read it out? One stains hundred comma thousand ten thousand hundred thousand comma million ten million hundred million comma billion. Okay. So now header introduction is done. Now we are going to write down one number and we will learn how to read this number. Okay, so same example I have used what I have already used for Indian header system. That's 7092343205. Oh my god. The 10 digit number, how to read it out? In this way, I cannot try, read na, that the number is, what is the number? 7092343205, what's that? Let us read this number with its proper header. Okay, so we should put the separator at the beginning. So where to put the separator or comma? 1, 10, 100, comma. 
thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, comma, million, ten million, hundred million, comma, billion. Okay? Now, seven billion, zero nine two, means what? Ninety two only. Ninety two million, Three four three. That is three hundred forty three. Three hundred forty three thousand two hundred five. So how have we divided the number into groups? That is three digit, three digit, three digit, one digit. Okay. So one two three four five six seven eight nine ten. Enter ten digit numbers. Again, I'm telling how to read this number. Seven billion ninety two million three hundred forty three thousand two hundred five. Once again, seven billion ninety two million three hundred forty three thousand two hundred five. That's all. So. How have I written the name of this number? Seven billion, seven billion, ninety-two million, ninety-two million, three hundred forty-three thousand, three hundred forty-three thousand, two hundred five, two hundred five. And how many digits are there? We have already calculated. It's a ten-digit. number